Hello you fantastic people and welcome back to Borderlands 3 for a super exciting video. I'm keen to bring it to you guys. The dedicated drop has been found for the hex grenade including the reoccurring hex, the merv hex, the cloning hex and just the regular hex. Pretty sure there's only four. If there's another one let me know in the comment section but they're the only ones I've found and regardless the reoccurring hex is the best grenade in the game in my opinion. Uh, pretty much well considered the top three OP grenades, one of the top three OP grenades. It's amazing. Uh, if you guys are watching this video, you likely know about it already. It has been nerfed. A lot of people thought, you know, it's not as good after that. But uh, I think pretty much the hex is only about the elemental damage. It does 2,726 damage per second uh, with 41% chance, which is really good. And the main thing about it, uh, particularly for the reoccurring hex, which just makes it so much better than the others, it splits into two grenades and then spawns three merv grenades on top of that. So you're just getting a crazy amount of grenades per one grenade you're throwing. Um, for comparison, I have got one of every single kind of grenade. Here is the cloning one for the stats for that. This one just splits into two grenades in the flight. The Merv Hex spawns three Merv grenades. And then just the regular Hex just homes in on the closest target like the rest of them. Doesn't split and it's just essentially a decent grenade, but it's only one grenade. But if you guys are watching this video, you'll likely know how amazing the Hex grenade is already. And just wanna know where it is. The dedicated drop is in Eden 6 down in the anvil and you'll spawn in originally in this location here i'll show you guys on screen but here's the map overall you can see in the top left corner back there just run through the big band camps through here uh follow my cursor or i'll just show you guys on screen in a second on times two speed of me doing an actual run but you want to make your way to this top corner here a target opportunity which is one of zero's um hunt challenges crew challenges and you want to eliminate the sky bullies there's actually two of them now i'll show you guys the run on screen while i explain the rest the main things to mention you can actually get this grenade on normal mode true volt hunter mode may have one two three or four in any combination of the above it is a dedicated drop so they have the same drop um, amount regardless of what level you're on regardless of what mayhems true volt hunter etc you are on um, the only difference is the higher mayhem level you have the higher chance of anointed drops you can get so if you guys can handle the mayhem for bullet sponge it is definitely worth doing because you might get some super awesome anointments on reoccurring hexes which just sound amazingly op now just coming up on screen you're about to run past the new use station in which you will save and quit and load back to which is amazing just have to run this short run after you've done the long one once once you go through this door you want to wait where i'm currently standing aim down sight to the other side of the room and they'll both spawn in through that door sometimes they're a little slow so you don't want to run straight away otherwise only one will spawn and you only half the chance of getting the hex that way um so definitely worth waiting a few seconds then you want to run around and then you know destroy them they have a decent chance of dropping the hex uh, out of the 10 runs i got two a merf hex and just a regular hex now these guys do actually have two other dedicated drops as well the shooting star shield was a dedicated drop from the start of the game and we've actually also confirmed the rebel yell which you guys can see on screen is an atlas assault rifle that has been confirmed a dedicated drop as well for these guys so if you're farming for the hex and you notice this uh it is already known as well i just knew you guys would be interested in the hex first because it is probably the best grenade in the game of course uh, but i'll likely make a gun review and let you guys know that you can get it from here again later on when i make a rebel yell and shooting star review but yeah that's all i have for the recurring hex super excited to find the dedicated drop for this one i'm gonna go farm it a million times and see if i can get an anointed one um i hope you guys found this video helpful if you did feel free to smash subscribe i'd really really appreciate it we just smashed through 800 subs last night while i was sleeping so thank you very much for that you guys are awesome pretty sure i just said awesome but anyway if you guys want to smash like and share with your friends so everyone can get the recurring hex or any variation of the hex that they want uh from the dedicated drop it is way way easier now you can for the record still get recurring hexes or any kind of hex from world drops word drops haven't been uh taken out of the game you can still get them randomly dropped from anywhere these will just have a much higher rate of drop so if you guys get it from somewhere else it will be a world drop legendary if you guys want to help out the community and try and test the dedicated drops yourselves the best way to do it is on normal mode no mayhem modifiers uh, because mayhem modifiers actually turn up the loot drop for world drops so that might skew your data and make it a little bit harder to determine which ones are dropping them because it's dedicated drops or just mayhem drops um, so we've only found about 10 in the community so far I think of confirmed places you can get legendaries uh, and I'm testing it myself I tested yesterday I killed Grave Ward 50 times and I found out the dedicated drops for him so I'll link that at the end screen so you guys can watch that because he's a super great place to farm 
Um, and then I'm going to continue farming Tront today. I'm going to continue going on with all the named enemies. So if you have any suggestions or places you guys have found out for dedicated drops, let us know in the comment section down below so everyone can get these awesome legendaries without having to farm a bajillion times of a particular boss for world drop legendaries. And yeah, other than that, I hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to smash subscribe, like, and share with your friends, and I shall see you guys next time. Adios.